I guess it was inspired by the piece upstairs. That was a mandala made of New York Times, which is, you know, the paper of record, but it's also my local paper because I live in New York. That mandala was to represent all of our voices, which is what I really am interested in, that all of our voices are heard and that we're together as one going forward into the future. So that's my dream. I first started doing this project years and years ago before I ever thought about mandalas really as, as pieces of art that I might make. And what it was called was women's work. And women's work in my head was like lace making, um, it was crochet, knitting, uh, embroidery, you know, all these kinds of, of hand works out of fibers. And I had studied fibers actually in college, but they were gigantic big pieces. They were not really hand work. And then I just, I don't know, somewhere it came to me that I would do this piece and it would be made with women sitting in chairs doing, you know, twisting newspaper. It represents all of us working together for an hour or so, one Sunday afternoon, and happily talking and sharing and being, and why can't we be this way all the time?